If you don't conquer yourself, you will be conquered by yourself, a psychological analysis. The quote, if you don't conquer yourself, you will be conquered by yourself, is a powerful reminder that our greatest enemy is often ourselves. It is a call to self-awareness, self-discipline, and self-mastery. In psychology, this quote can be interpreted in a number of ways. One interpretation is that our internal conflicts, such as our fears, insecurities, and negative thoughts, can have a significant impact on our behavior and well-being. If we do not learn to manage these internal conflicts, they can control us and lead us to make self-destructive choices. Another interpretation of the quote is that our own self-limiting beliefs and negative thought patterns can prevent us from achieving our full potential. If we do not believe in ourselves, it is difficult to achieve our goals and dreams. Finally, the quote can also be interpreted as a cautionary tale about the dangers of unchecked ego and ambition. If we are too focused on our own needs and desires, we may lose sight of what is truly important in life and end up harming ourselves and others. How to conquer yourself? So, how do we conquer ourselves? The first step is to become more aware of our own thoughts, feelings, and behaviors. We need to identify our internal conflicts, self-limiting beliefs, and negative thought patterns. Once we are aware of these things, we can begin to challenge them and develop more positive and helpful ways of thinking and behaving. Another important step in conquering ourselves is to develop self-discipline. This means learning to control our impulses and make choices that are in our best interests, even when they are difficult. It also means setting goals for ourselves and working towards them with determination. Finally, we need to develop self-mastery. This means learning to accept ourselves for who we are, flaws and all. It also means developing our strengths and talents and using them to make a positive impact on the world. Conclusion Conquering ourselves is a lifelong journey. It is not something that happens overnight. However, it is a journey that is well worth taking. When we conquer ourselves, we free ourselves from our own limitations and become capable of achieving great things. Here are some additional tips for conquering yourself. Practice mindfulness. Mindfulness is the practice of paying attention to the present moment without judgment. When we are mindful, we are more aware of our thoughts, feelings, and sensations. This awareness can help us to identify and challenge our negative thoughts and beliefs. Meditate. Meditation is another practice that can help us to develop self-awareness and self-discipline. Meditation involves sitting quietly and focusing on our breath. Over time, meditation can help us to calm our minds and develop greater control over our thoughts and emotions. Journal. Journaling is a great way to reflect on our thoughts and feelings. It can also help us to identify patterns in our behavior and develop strategies for change. Seek professional help. If you are struggling to conquer yourself on your own, consider seeking professional help from a therapist or counselor. A therapist can help you to understand your internal conflicts and develop coping mechanisms. Remember, conquering yourself is a journey not a destination. Be patient and kind to yourself along the way.